Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in and please don't forget to subscribe while you're here. So you guys, this past weekend was Labor Day weekend and I could say I did a little bit, a little bit of some sum. That all entails that my husband and I decided to take my brother-in-law uh, for his 16th birthday um, to the Apex. Um, for you guys who are not familiar with the Apex, um, it's literally a big, huge arcade slash Dave and Buster's slash. Um, basically, they just have everything that you can imagine, which includes like go karts, um, mini golf, laser tag bowling pool rope climbing bumper cars um race cars so yeah they have a lot there um but yeah we decided to take him first birthday for some reason him and my husband don't really i guess like to celebrate their birthday or do big things for it um as i i have to celebrate my birthday to me, another year is just, it's a celebration because anyway, so we decided to take them to the Apex. Um, and you guys, we decided to get on the ropes course. And um, we decided to go on the ropes course and go ax throwing. Um, my, he, my brother, he never did ropes or ax throwing, which I thought was, you know, something new for him to try. So, you know, we had to go ahead and try that. So, here are the ropes. Um, I actually have been roped um, kind of before. Um, and just like the last time, I am still was still a bit scared here. Um, there goes my brother-in-law. And you guys, let's just say he stayed up here for a long time. I done went through three courses. Well, three little patterns of pathways and he stayed right there for the longest time and would not move because he was scared y'all ever seen a weak zip line well here you go this is the weakest i ever seen struggle so on our to the right this is the person struggling over there. Yeah, that's Brandon. I dared him to get onto one of the paths cause, because it was kind of hard. It's like going over a rolling log um, with no grip. Um, but he got up there and was determined to complete all of the paths given, um, which he did to see, even though you can see him struggling from time to time. I'm not even going to lie. I didn't even complete all of them because I was just so nervous. And this is the perfect zip line now. Way better than mine. Looking like he in the jungle somewhere. Ah! 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 So here is the axe throwing, you guys. I definitely is, can say I'm not a pro at this. Uh, my little brother definitely was good. He may have missed the first two and like one every once in a while. But, you know, your girl right here just kept missing back and back to back to back. Eventually, I got the hang of it, but it took me a while. Um, so, yeah, I think being from the country has a bit of an advantage for him. <laughs> But yeah, he was good. And when you do go axe throwing, you get a whole hour um, to throw. So, you know, this was definitely a workout. So eventually, as we kept throwing, you know, I was like, you know what? Come on, coach, the person who was guiding us, our trainer, go against my little brother because I'm tired. And y'all too good. I just can't do this. So look, dead on. He was that good. And the coach was okay. Warning, the following stunts were performed by professionals. Do not try this at home. Y 
y'all i tell you that man got up there and my husband is the most cockiest person you will meet when it comes to a challenge he did he looked like a little girl i was dying you guys but eventually he ended up getting a lot of bullseyes he, he, he did his thing but when he first got up there woo child, he, mm, he was far worse than i was and it ain't for me you guys you seen that clip <laughs> and he's such a character when he you know does something right or when he acts a fool he was, he's very extra sometimes it's like you know we don't really know him so i was like all right y'all let's go because we don't know him <laughs> just embarrassing you guys but overall we had a good time um we were able to learn who's good at what, especially for me and not good at axe throwing. So if you guys ever take me out in the woods and you know, all we have is something to throw at people, uh, it's just not gonna work out for yeah. me. Everything was good. Um, I definitely, you know, if you would like to go, definitely take your kids. Please don't take them on the weekends at nighttime because I don't understand why kids should be out at nighttime. I feel like they should have like an age limit um, after hours because it is an adult thing too. And who wants to be walking around with a lot of little kids? Nobody. By the way, you guys, the reason why I keep wearing these hats is because I have these stitch braids in my head and they are two weeks old and I don't think I was taking much care of them. So I'm wearing these hats every day to like cover it up. But this is what's gonna have to do. You either take it or you don't. Well guys, thank you for tuning into my video. I hope you enjoyed. If you have anything that you would like for me to post in the future or any topics, please comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. All right, bye.